Everyone talks about the richest kings in the world. Kings from the wealthiest countries of the world have accumulated immense wealth and managed to make it to the rich list. But have you ever wondered about their queens? Have you ever wondered who the richest queens in the world are? In this video, we take a look at the wealthiest queens from around the world. Stay tuned and watch. Before we begin this video, if you're new to the channel, make sure you like and subscribe to the channel. Turn on the bell for the latest notifications and updates. That way you'll never miss a video from us. With that said, let's not waste any more time and get right into today's content. Queen Masanat Mohato Siso At number 10, we have the Queen of Lesotho, Queen Masanat Mohato Siso. Not many have heard of this small country. Lesotho is a small mountainous and landlocked country surrounded by its much larger neighbor, South Africa. At the age of 24, Masanat became Queen of Lesotho when she married King Letsi III. The Queen of Lesotho is well known for spreading social awareness and doing charity. The net worth of Queen Masanat lies between two and a half to five million dollars. A large portion of these earnings come from the government of Lesotho, which pays the Queen every year, and another portion of her income comes from the family's own success. Queen Norodom Mononith At number nine is Queen Norodom Mononith. Her Highness is the Queen Mother of Cambodia, a country in Southeast Asia. Queen Norodom married King Norodom Sihanouk in 1955. She was the sixth wife of the king and she was the dominating queen of all the other queens. She was coronated in 1999 and officially became the queen of the nation. After being crowned as Queen Norodom Mononith started playing an active role in politics. On several occasions, she consorted to the king and served in the royal house as the queen consort of Cambodia from 1993 to 2004. She is also known for her generous nature, which became evident when she donated $1.5 million to the government of Cambodia for research on the Mind Free Cambodia campaign. The net worth of the queen is about $6 million, a huge chunk of which comes from the government of Cambodia. The government also takes care of the other expenses of this 86-year-old queen of the nation. Queen Sylvia of Sweden Next on the list is Queen Sylvia, the queen of the Nordic country of Sweden. Queen Sylvia met Carl XVI Gustav in 1972 in Munich during the Olympic Games where she was chief hostess. She was a trained interpreter without either royal or noble origins. Four years later, she became part of the royal house of Bernadotte and became Queen of Sweden by marrying King Carl XVI in 1976. This queen is known for her elegance, intelligence, and work toward the welfare of the people. Her status as queen didn't stop her from doing charity work in the country and worldwide. The net worth of the queen is about $10 million. The queen doesn't receive a monthly salary, but the government makes an annual payment of $8 million to the royal house and part of it goes to the queen. She also earns from her celebrity status in the world. Queen Letitia of Spain Next up at seven is the Queen of Spain, Letitia Ortiz Roca Solano. She was born in a middle-class family but established herself as a journalist and news reporter on news channels like CNN Plus and Television Española. Her life changed when she met Prince Felipe VI in 2002 while covering a story as a reporter. Two years later, she got married to the prince and became the queen of the country. The net worth of the queen is about $10 million. The government of Spain contributes $9 million to the royal house annually and some part of it goes to the queen. The Queen of Spain lives with the king and her three children in the palace of Zarzuela in the capital of Madrid. Queen Sonia of Norway Up next we have Queen Sonia of Norway. She belongs to the royal house of Glucksburg. Queen Sonia was not born into a royal family. Her life changed when she met Crown Prince Harold in 1959. They dated for nine years before getting married on January 17, 1991. Sonia became Norway's first queen consort at 54. The queen lives a luxurious life where she gets to enjoy living in the Grand Royal Palace of Oslo and ride in a super yacht like the KS Norge. The net worth of the queen is about $15 million. She enjoys special celebrity status in the country. The king and queen are also exempt from paying any taxes. Queen Suthita of Thailand Queen Suthita is the current Thai queen. However, she, like many other queens on this list, was not born in a royal. Queen Suthita was born in a middle-class Thai family. She had a career as a flight attendant. She was later appointed commander of Crown Prince Vajira Longcorn's household guard in August 2014. She continues to serve the king in different official roles, like commander of the special operations units of the King's Guard, and in 2017 she became the official consort of the King of Thailand. 
they both loved each other and in 2019 married to make her the Queen Mother of Thailand. The net worth of Queen Suthita is about $35 million, which comes from the royal treasury on the king's orders. Queen Margaret II of Denmark The Danish queen belongs to the royal house of Oldenburg. All the members of this royal household have the title of prince and princess except the queen. It will amaze you when you learn there is no king of Denmark. Even the husband of Queen Margaret Henrik is called the prince. She married consort Prince Henrik in 1972 and he consorted her from that point. Apart from being a queen, she is also commander-in-chief of the Danish royal house. The net worth of the Queen of Denmark is about $40 million. The queen also owns nine castles around the world, but she and Prince Henrik have spent their life in Amelienborg Castle in Copenhagen. The queen also gets a salary of $10 million annually from the government of Denmark. Queen Maxima of the Netherlands This 51-year-old queen is known for her looks and for advocating for various social issues. She currently serves as the United Nations Secretary General Special Advocate for Inclusive Finance for Development. She met Prince Willem Alexander in Spain in 1999, and after three years of dating, she married the prince. Later, when the queen abdicated, the prince became the king and Princess Maxima became Queen Maxima. The net worth of the queen is about $300 million. The queen also receives a huge sum of money from the government of the Netherlands, which is the annual amount of $49 million for the salaries of the royal members. The government also takes care of the expenses of the king and queen in the country. Queen Rania of Jordan Up next, we move away from Europe and go to the Middle East. Our next queen on the list is Queen Rania of Jordan. Queen Rania is a celebrity queen and well-known philanthropist famous for her welfare work and stunning looks. She became part of the royal house of Hashemite when she married the King of Jordan Abdullah II in the year 1993. She is the queen consort of the King of Jordan. Queen Rania is closely related to the Queen Rania Foundation and other NGOs for the betterment of human life. She also performs representative duties, such as representing the royal house on official occasions. The net worth of the queen is about $558 million. All of this comes from the National Treasury of Jordan, which allows a few million per year for members of the royal family of Jordan. The queen lives a luxurious lifestyle in the multi-million dollar grand palace of al Makar, along with the king and their children. Queen Elizabeth The richest queen of the world was the queen from Europe, Her Highness Queen Elizabeth II of the UK. The queen was born to the former King George VI. She was the princess of the UK, but after the king's death, she ascended the throne in February 1952. She was just 25 years of age at the time. Before her passing in September this year, the net worth of the queen was about $600 million, of which $107 million comes from the government. According to Forbes, the Queen held nearly $28 billion in assets and $19 billion worth of this crown state. The Queen lived in Buckingham Palace. The palace is valued at more than $14 billion. The Queen also owned the firm company, which is worth more than $28 billion, and it is believed that there were many other properties that were not disclosed. Following the Queen's death, King Charles, the current head of the UK, inherited all the Queen's assets and properties. That's it for this video. Hope you enjoyed watching this one. Thanks for watching.